Welcome back to King Narai. Today is another King's official build. Now, I don't really typically make a lot of videos on this uh, playlist. There's only two of them so far. Because the guns that I put in here, I am not allowed to change ever. So, if I make an official build for that gun, I either delete the video if I find a new build or something else. But it has to be able to stand the test of time. And it has to be my legitimate build that will not change. With that being said, it has to be a good behind build for me to keep it there. And so far, I've only found three. And with that being said, today is the next one. It's not my build per se, rather Kills. Kills gave it to me, Killer Beast, you, you all remember him. We've been through a lot together. He gave me the build when he first gave it to me. I wasn't really feeling it, and I really didn't like it that much, but... Then when I got the Mythic Templar and I got like some new iron sights on it and I had actually been messing around with it because it's a legendary, I knew automatically that this build was nasty. Problem with it was I wasn't as skilled with it, but I've been playing some ranked with it and it still is nasty. This build is solid. The only thing for me, and I'm not trying to have this be too long, is I don't know how this test of time will be because these type of guns, they'll nerf. And then it won't be as good, especially when, like, a lot of people are using it because of the legendary. They'll nerf it. It won't be as good as they may buff it. It changes a lot, so it's kind of risky putting this out. But anyway, here's the build. We got the monolithic suppressor for the damage downrange. We got the OWC marksman for more damage downrange and a bit of recoil control. We've got no stock to try to balance it out. I questioned this build when he first gave it to me, but believe me, it rocks. We got quicker ADS time, of course, the movement speed and the ADS movement speed all improved, but we take a big hit on the vertical. With that, we put the OWC laser tactical. When you ADS, they will be able to see your laser, so take it with a grain of salt and then slay the hand as the perk. I absolutely love this build because I'm not a super aggressive person and I can kind of like beam them with it. Like any gun range that's not like super up close, you likely won't beat me. Even if you have an assault rifle, this thing competes and you'll see that in the video. Ah, uh, let's go. A pretty good map. Looks like we're going against a pretty good player. No way Nuketown won. Alright, so with domination, it's all about holding positioning. So hopefully I'll be able to demonstrate it. As many, masses, or as, as many matches as it takes is what we're going to do. If I can get it done in one, we got it. If I can get it done in two, we got it. All right, give him a short tap on there. What the heck are you doing up there? I don't know how I didn't get the kill, but... Bro, what are you doing up there? I gotta reload. Go around on that one. Oh, I thought that was an enemy. Alright, so... I'll, ooh. See, I don't know why I'm lagging. It's, it's always when I'm recording that I'm lagging, but... It's not bad, but, like, the frame rate isn't as fast as it was before. Like, I would have been able to see that in time to get it off. Nice. And the headshot multiplier is crazy, but, like, I just keep hitting headshots. I don't... Like, again, I don't use aim assist, so it's not me getting the headshots. It's whatever. I don't know how the first... Okay. I'm not gonna get upset, because that, that gives them the power. Nice. Teammates cleaning up. I do want a moderately hard game, if you understand what I'm saying. Like, I don't want it to be given to me. See, look at the lag. Oh... Alright, my grandfather called. I was like, what the heck? And now it's going to be laggy for the rest of the match because after each phone call, if I'm still recording, it's going to be laggy. And I hate having to talk about that every time I'm recording, but I should be getting a new phone soon. It's the only thing that's going to save it. But like, I was like, I better get this kill. I could have gotten both if I didn't lag, I believe. Man, what are you doing? And I lagged. Oh my god. The lag is bad. I don't want to sit there and talk about it all match. I want to demonstrate this. Hey, yeah, yeah. Alright, we're going to try to hold off. 
at C, we know they're there. I do want to use claw, but we're demonstrating the gun. Fried. See, it's me who's missing shots in there, but as, if you can get like a solid beam, you'll see what I'm saying. This thing is an absolute beast. There's so many times I've gotten into fights with like dudes who's using an assault rifle. The only thing I've been able to see beat it is like a a good Odin, like a person who doesn't miss a shot with the Odin, or a good Creek Six, I'd say something like that. But I wouldn't even say Creek Six gets it. It's just I do miss shots. If I were to hit every shot, then there would be no chance you would beat me with this bison, I guarantee you. But the fact that I do, there are certain guns that on average are able to beat me, and that's one of them. Oh, why are they like... I knew somebody was going to spawn there, I accept the death, but why... Why the first guy not shoot at me, but then the second guy did? Like, it feels so weird right now. Nice triple. See, if you hit shots, it's an absolute beat. Where am I getting? Okay, that's so weird. And I love this loadout. Beat it. Huh? I'm, uh, I'm, look, look at the bullets just on the wall. I don't understand that. I, like, I hit his collarbone. I know it. I know I did. Oh, on my uh, Man of War death side, I got like one more pull, so next time they have a double CP and they have mythic character or something, of course I'm going to get that, but I'll also be getting the Man of War, so that's future things to come as well. More content of Call of Duty coming to the channel. I don't know why every time that dude comes across my screen, I think it's a bad guy. Nah, not that time. I ain't missing it that time. But I missed that. Teammates got gotcha. you. Oh, clear. See, I, like I'm saying, I, I do want them to be moderately hard so that I'm not, like, just relying on my team. And i not like, well, the people you played, they were trash, so that's the only reason this gun is doing good. But really, in all honesty, I'm trash. The only reason I'm making this video is because, like, for three or four matches straight and ranked against real people who are good, I was able to just destroy them with this. It felt amazing, and it has felt amazing for a long time since getting, of course, the legendary. But I didn't know how much I wanted to make this a video because it, it definitely, it definitely could fall off. Like, if they take a little bit of the damage away, because the damage downrange is ridiculous. Watch. If one of them peek around that corner, watch. I was not expecting it to come from that side. Peek, 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 peek. Nope, I'm not going to camp right there. Spawning behind us? Nope, still in front of us. Why is he staying crouched the entire match? Alright, good game. So, see, it's not going to take one match. It's at least going to take two because that wasn't a good demonstration. All right, game two back on Nuketown. It's like a beloved map or something. I don't know how that beat out Standoff because Standoff is like where I first, not where I first, but like in ranked, I was like, okay, yeah, this Bison's overpowered because I was able to watch positions and just hold them down. It's going to be a little bit harder here because I don't know the positions like that and there's a lot more ways to move around, but nevertheless... Let's go for a beam right here. No beam. I feel like I'm playing bots right now. Yeah, I'm playing bots. Why? All day yesterday, I'm playing real players. Why am I playing bots right now? My teammates are real players. I think part of their team is real, but that one dude was for sure fake. Yeah, him. Yeah, that that that's crazy. I just died to the bot that I was complaining about. That was supposed to be a slide, but I had no momentum. What the heck? Alright, I'm not that bad. I'm not that bad. That that's like a once one time thing right there. 
That's a one time thing, because. Attacks. Okay, he's going through the house. No, he's not. He stayed in it, but enemy in sight. Guardian is ready to be deployed. Nice streak starting to get hot, but I feel bad because it's against bots. And like, I, I wish it was, because that's clearly a bot. So I'm trying to like keep killing the one dude who I know is a real player, but they might all be bots. And I don't know why, because I was like, they were making me get real players earlier. Or yesterday, I should say, because this is a new day of me recording. But... They were sitting there making me get role players, and now it's like, oh, well, you can have bots now. Okay, now you see that beam? That's when you don't miss a shot, and I guarantee you, I, I think an assault rifle can kill you quicker than that. But most of the time I'm hitting headshots or something, it's so weird. But, like, you can't really challenge me with that. I'm going to switch to claw. Hope they come that way. Fire some warnings. Oh, they, oh, they went upstairs. All right, claw over. You know, I will say, I felt more safe with the claw. The fact that I felt I needed to switch means I felt more safe with the claw as opposed to my bison. Which is not the point of the video and, and not good at all, but... Come back here! Mistake. And I missed those shots. My fingers were on the wrong spot on the controller, so. You're gonna be like, how the heck does that happen? Well, it was not on. No, that's just me. It was not on the analog stick the way it should have been. Wow, I'm just. Okay, game two done. On to game three. Hey, we got MVP though. Okay, thank you. Now I think it's real players, and please don't pick I Rise. Thank you. This might be a good map. As long as I'm not selling my shots, this is going to demonstrate exactly what I want to demonstrate. Now, these are real players. All day yesterday, I was getting real players. Like, I am only pro 2 because the only reason I did ranked was so that I could, like, demonstrate the gun. Because I don't really play ranked that much because I know I can't hit Grandmaster 3, which is the only reason for me to play. And why can't you? Because it takes too long to get into a match. Now, normally, I wouldn't complain that I'm getting put in fast matches against bots and get to, like, level up extremely fast for for basically no risk. But the fact that I'm trying to demonstrate this thing is the problem. And the frame rate is a little low. Not bad. Okay, they're right there. That's a bad angle for me. When I'm high, I can't really shoot down that well. I should have executed him, but we, we can demonstrate the build to him. All right, help me out on C. They're probably going to come from behind us. Oh, the heck you ain't. Okay, see, if my teammate wasn't there, I probably would have gotten that kill. I feel like I would have missed the last shots, but... What I'm saying is, he had first shot on me, he missed his shots, but like, I can flick with this gun and command. Oh no, I shot above him! I shot above him! Let me get straight, sorry about the noise y'all just heard. Let me get straight. Peek, you peeking? You got the UAV up. No, y'all not gonna defend that? And that means y'all are on your way to B. Teammate, please take A. It's wide open for you, I gotta go take B.
Oh my god, that's such a bet. Now, I'm not good with those shots. That's the only reason. Those shots that are like head glitches or ones where I have to like jump to get a good shot off. I'm not good with them. I got to work on it. Look at the beam. Now, that's the bison when you don't miss a shot. And it's hard to beat. Now, that's the bison when you suck. And it is extremely easy to beat, but not. Nah, you get the point. I'm not trying to crack it up more than what it is, but it, it is a very good build. Fits my play style. That's a bot. And I just died to a bot. Or is it a bot? I, I don't even know. I think it's a bot. It had a real player's face, but I still think it was a bot. Maybe not a bot, because that was, that was decent. He's either a bot or he's trash. But I died to him, so that means I'm, I'm worse trash than even him. And get me out of here. Reload. Teammates neutralized it. Okay, nice. Yeah, I was wondering. I was like, our entire team is holding down middle. They got to be somewhere. I'm clawing this. Goodbye. I'm going to go claw mid. They're over here. Oh, no. They were over there. I promise you. There's at least one of them because I heard the footsteps and I knew they were coming through one way. Should have trusted my bison, you'd say. Yeah, probably so, but... I mean... I, I'm not crazy. Okay, see, that's when you hit headshots. And I don't know what's been going on with the video. I haven't been hitting headshots like that, but... You can really get long range... You see this? Like, when you hit the headshot... Whenever I go long range, I can, like, hit head headshots all of a sudden. Well, that was a good... That was another headshot. Oh, he's fried. He's fried. There's multiple of them, though. It's multiple. And he had a sniper. You had a sniper that entire time? And a SVD? Okay. All right. All right. Stop. I'm, I'm getting annoying right now, aren't I? But nah. I cannot believe. Man had a full-on SVD and still, still took that long. Get your knife up out of here. Oh, there's another? He dead. Look how many bullets I missed dead now i'm hitting my shots and poor guy with the rocket launcher he's like bro can you chill i'm like no i feel like i've demonstrated it at this point so this will probably be the last match three matches not too bad a gameplay i hate when i have to wait till like the last match to get my point across because then most people don't actually see it because most people don't stay to the last part and like they see the first one and if it looks bad they're like that's not... That. I can take damage by my own guardian? Oh, that's so dumb. That's so dumb. That's my guardian. That's no different than a sentry gun. I should be able to stand in, on, in front of my own sentry gun and it shouldn't be friendly fire. There's another one. No, you... You ruined my streak. Oh my god, he ruined my streak. And I know there was another one over there. Oh, that was perfect. Dang it. I just did not adjust to it quick enough. That was perfect, though. Dang, I knew they were over there. He ruined my freaking streak. I don't know why you're just sitting there. And why you're just sitting there. It's like, I know I get paranoid after I capture objectives, but when I sit there and I'm not moving, then I know I'm not going to get a kill. But, like, if I am moving, let's take you out. I could have just killed him, but I thought it was more than just him. But I forget. Why are you running around with this? Because you have a sniper, of course. I can't stand my own guardian. That's ridiculous. Supposed to be a guardian, not a... I don't even know what to call it at this point. Because it's not guarding me. It's, it's more the problem. Free fire. Free fire. Alright, thanks for watching. Definitely could have did a better job. Like, I wish I was recording <laughs> the first two matches before I started recording. But, anyway, I think you get the objective. You're probably a better player than I am, so I would highly suggest you try it out and see what you can do. I will also say the legendary skin of it, that's what makes it pretty good for me. Like, the iron sights are a bit different. It has the dot on it. 
maybe try to experiment with the iron sights. I'm not sure if the Bison has any custom iron sights. I just know I can't really rock with the Bison iron sights. But if you can, and you like more passive gameplay or able to beam them from long range, and you don't like to like straight up push and be aggressive, and as long as you're not into that, this build should be pretty good for you. Get your shots good, and as you see, the headshot multiplier is crazy damage down range ridiculous the one thing it's missing is like the close range stuff but even at that it can still kill all right thanks for watching